Hello students. Today we are going to see how to convert the decimals into like decimals. Means unlike decimals are given. We have to convert this unlike decimals into like decimals. And how to convert the fraction into decimal fraction. So here are some examples. Let us solve question number one. Is topic is convert into like decimals. Okay, unlike decimals are given. We have to convert that unlike decimals into like decimals. Okay, so let us solve first one. That is six point three. Is 
to put three zeros here, it becomes two point five zero zero zero. Now it is already. Now next one is forty six point zero. We have to make it four. So put three zeros. It becomes forty six point zero 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 zero. Okay. So the method is you just observe the maximum number of decimal place values, and according to that, we have to extend, we have to increase the zero in the decimal place value of other decimals given in the question. Okay. Now next topic is convert into decimal fractions. Okay, in normal fraction numbers are given here. We have to convert them into decimal fraction. Okay, question number one is twenty-seven upon four. Okay, it's very simple. We just have to divide these numbers. So on dividing, we are getting just to divide the number twenty-seven by four. Okay, four sixes are twenty-four. Remainder is seven minus four is three. Two minus two is zero. Three we cannot divide by four. Let us put point here. When we put point here, zero will come. It becomes thirty. Again the table of four. Four seven is a twenty-eight. Thirty minus twenty-eight is two. Okay. Now again point is there. So zero. Then it becomes twenty-four. Five is a Twenty. Twenty minus twenty is zero. Okay. So here, what we are getting? Six point seven five. Six point seven five is the decimal fraction of this twenty seven upon four. Okay. This twenty we can subtract. Twenty we are getting. Twenty minus twenty is zero. Zero remainder is left. That means we are getting the answer that is six point seven five. Okay, and six point seven five is a decimal fraction. Okay, so it's very simple to convert this fraction into decimal fraction. We just divide them directly and get the answer in decimal form. Okay, there will be no remainder left. Okay, now the next number is given in a form of fixed fraction. Okay. Same we have to do here also. Let us solve first. The question is four seven upon eight. First, convert this four seven upon eight into improper fraction. That is four eight is a thirty two. Thirty two plus seven is thirty nine. Thirty nine upon eight. Okay. Now same like previous answer. What we have to do? We just divide. On dividing. We are getting just to divide this thirty nine by eight. Thirty nine divided by eight, thirty eight. Four is a thirty two. Nine minus two is seven. Three minus three is zero. Okay. Now put point here. Here seventy eight eight is a sixty four. Again subtract seventy minus sixty four is six. Okay, then again six minus six is zero. Then point is there. It becomes sixty. Again, the table of eight eight seven is a fifty six. Okay, sixty minus fifty six is four. Now zero. It becomes forty eight five is a forty. Forty minus forty is zero. Now the Question that we are getting is four point eight seven five. Four point eight seven five is a decimal fraction of this thirty nine upon eight. Okay, so it's very simple for converting the fraction into decimal fraction. We just divide them directly and get the answer with no remainder left. Okay, thank you.